we're still a little early in the year, but we're now getting word of some of the big releases. This well, shit, year. let me know because I'm and I'm. I don't even look at the internet no more when it comes to that shit. I'm so, so, so you don't know what's coming out this year. Okay, so I've been spoiled to see things like I saw Air Mags three years before they came out. That just so happens because I was on campus. Okay, I had to hold that secret forever. Okay, I saw Flyknits before they came out. Okay, I've held Flyknit Air Forces in my hand. They've never come out yet. They might never come out, but I've held them in my hand. Mm-hmm. So I don't know what the hell's coming out. All right, well, let's. I'll I'll go through a few of the big releases this year that's coming out. The De La Solos are coming. Yeah, the same one as the High. The shout out to Plug Plug One is my man. I love right. that's my dude. Like the that's my guy. Air we Jordan Seven Hairs are coming out. I have hairs from before, but I'll, right. I'll get. I'll definitely get a pair of hairs when they come. In. They're finally coming out with the the Jordan Eleven Bread Lows. Yeah, I'm, I, I like that. Right. Uh, the Air Jordan One Chicago's are coming out. Air Jordan One Chicago. I like. I'm looking. I'm looking forward to the one that he wore in that game in Italy, the black and ar- the black and orange mm-hmm. joints. I'm looking forward to those, only because I got a I got an AP to match those. Air Jordan Five Space Jams. Couldn't 13, care less. Th- th- Thirteen low playoffs. Couldn't care less. Um, the Jordan One uh, Shattered Backboards. That's the one I'm talking about. The orange one. The orange That's ones. the one he, in, in that game in Italy. Yeah, yeah, I like that. Those I like those a lot. Um, the Bordeaux's are coming back out. I got, I got so many Bordeaux. The, the seven, the seven Bordeaux. I got so Which many Which is interesting because those came out somewhat recently. They, they retro those quick because usually there's long periods of time. Still got those. three pair of those. That's right. The the six low black metallics. The I can live with six lows. I like six lows. The Air Jordan Nine uh, Militia. Those are coming back out in August. Those get my thumbs up. Uh, the Ghost Green Air Jordan Six Lows. I like some shit Marshawn Lynch will wear. Couldn't care less. <laughs> Uh, I mean, there's the 14s, uh, the Jordan 8 3 Pete's. Who? The Jordan 8. Oh, I'm not a big fan. I, I, the 8s are too big. 8s okay. is too. Yeah. The, the one UNC's? Yeah, I like those. The 7 sweaters? No. It should look like something out of Do the Right Thing or something. I don't like those. Okay. And, I mean, the big one this year so far that they've announced is the, the 8 Aquas, but you don't like 8s. Okay. Who cares about Aqua 8s? And the, the 8 Chromes. You don't care about eights, so they haven't they haven't announced that there's going to be. I mean, but there is going to be an eleven in December because they've been doing that for I don't know how long at this point. Um, Maybe they'll drop that all red one. All red. Elevens. Yeah. So out of all those that, that I've one named, they made for Mellow. Maybe they're coming out with that. Who knows? If you look at all the ones that I've named, including all the ones that have already come out, what do you think is the the most anticipated? You know, release this year. Vlad, I don't even remember what the hell came out already. <laughs> um, I would have to look through. And, I would have to look well, the, the, through the, my the, shoes. Uh, I mean, Black, I can tell you. Hold on, hold on. You told me to a guy. You told me to a guy that gets seven to ten pair of sneakers every week. Like, okay, I, I, eleven. I, I mean, the eleven lab fours just came out. Obviously, I like, I like those. Um, you know, the seven Barcelonas. I'm, I'm very happy with the fragment ones. I love fragment ones. The fragment ones I love came the out. Fragment was, ones. That, was that this year, or last year? Frag. Oh, who the hell knows? Last year, probably. I like. I like this year. I like the Dover Streets. Uh, Jeter shoe was last year too, then, right? You know what I'm saying? But like, I mean, I like the. Eh, who cares? I'm you not know, into all, that. all the. You know you what's know. funny? I stopped doing all those top year list year things and reviews. I buy so many goddamn shoes, and I buy so many GRs too that I like. Uh, you know, a shoe that I actually like that I, that people fuck with, but didn't completely fuck with, is the, the ZX Flux Zenos. Because yeah, Flux is a comfortable. Like they just that's the thing about Adidas right now. Their comfortability is on point right yeah. now. Like they going that route. They winning in that route right now. Yeah. Like that shit is comfortable. I mean, the the one Dover Streets came out, uh the all red foams came out. I love those by the way. I didn't see a pair here. Yeah, I got them. Sure. I got them. Yeah, I got them. It's funny cuz when I got mine, I got mine for All-Star weekend before everybody else got yeah. there. I got mine before the, I got mine way before those came out. The ones you got on your feet. The, right. Um I had them shit super early. And I think I just I got a pair for Jada Kiss in the car actually. Right. So Kiss for the 12th time that I've been calling you and you keep telling me you're not here. Right. Pick up your damn phone and let me get your shoes, please. I mean, I mean, the, the, I'm gonna sell them shits. The, the mirror, I'm joking, the, I don't sell shoes. <laughs> the mirror foams that I'm wearing right now. I love those. You know the the just on twos. You know the. I just Jordan. raved about just on twos. So like they were the just on twos. It's like like I said. Would you I, say I, the just on twos so far? I mean. I the, might like the Dover Streets more than the just ons. Really? Yeah, because blue is my color. Navy blue is my color. 
you know. And Jordan the, the, ones look so much like Air Forces. The, so. the double nickel tens. No, I hate tens. You hate tens. I hate Broadway, Chicago. I hate. The, I hate. The, I can't stand tens. Jordan tens is like no good to me. Uh, I mean the gold foams. I don't think those were. If it was shiny gold, I would have liked it. Right. Oh, you talking about shoes in general? I thought you was just talking about Jordans. Shoes in general. If you you know the the Marvin Martians, Marvin Martian sevens. I mean, I'm just going through all the releases this year. Yeah. Hold on. Hold nah, on. nah. I mean, there's a lot of Air Maxes that I like. I like some of the patches. Like, one of my favorites this year was the patch Air Max 1. The red, white, and blue patch Air Max 1 right here. Mm-hmm. I love this shoe. Like, the, I love this shoe right here. The four here. Oreos or, or the four, you know, the white and blue fours. I like the uh, white and, I like the white and blue Columbia fours more than I like the, what you want to call it, or Carolina, whatever you want to call those things. I mean, the, the Easy Boost, this is all stuff that came out this year. Uh, the boost, like I said, Boost was, Boost was, I don't turn down gifts. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So... You know, I like a lot. I like the Hirachi play this year. The Hirachi play was good this year. I like the Cork ninety. Um, I really like the 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 All Star. I mean, sorry, the the bread Air Maxes. The bread Air Max was good. Did they ever release the blue one? Or no, I don't think so. The, they got a royal one coming. I saw that one already. The bread, the bread Air Max one was dope too. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Kinda... But I, I like to play on Hirachis this year. I like the whole. Like I said, probably my favorite right now had to be the Mac, the the Patch Air Max one. I really love the Patch Air Max one. I so you think out of order. all the shoes, you know, the, the, the French Blue 7s that we have over there. Um, Somebody bought me those. I ain't buy those. I wouldn't have bought them. You know, all the all the Kobe's and LeBron's. I don't like the LeBron 12, all the, nor the Kobe. Like I said, nor the Kobe 10. Uh, I like the Kobe 9 a lot. Kobe 10 I didn't like. I mean, like I said, the 10, I don't, the 10 low I don't like. Um, that's about it. So out, out of all those shoes that we just named, including all the future shoes, if you were to pick... So far, the top release, the single, the single best release. My favorite, or what I think is the best. Both. My favorite right now would be the Air Max One right here. So this to you is the top release this year. You would put these over. This is my favorite release. Your favorite release. This is my favorite release so far. Over the Just Dons and the Mirror Foams and everything. Yeah, yeah. This is my favorite release so far. What is it about this release? I mean, it's just a simple, like, the Air Max has always been one of the classic silhouettes, so if it ain't Air Forces for me, and, you know, if it, take away the Air Force and the Jordan. Air Force ones haven't been great this year. So you take away the Air Force, and you take away the Jordan play. Like, to me, like, this shoe is just dope, man. Like, they, they you know, the, the, the whole patch thing, it doesn't make a difference to me. It's just the color blocking in this Air Max one. It's like everything old school, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? You got your, you got your basic gray, your basic blues, your hit of red. And it's the Air Max silhouette. I mean, you know what I'm saying? You get a little hit on the air bubble. Like, I just love the shoe. I've been wearing this shoe a lot lately. A whole lot, as you can see. I've been wearing this shoe a whole lot. And I wanted like three or four of these. And this is my favorite on this. If you ask me what I think the hottest shoe so far that released, yeah. it's probably a toss up between the Just Dawn and the, and, the, and the Dover Street right now. Again, Just Dawn did his thing when you take the whole silhouette that everybody's not a fan of and the luxury play on it with the Chanel bag inspiration and all that. Like, I think that's dope. And be, you know, putting his twist on it. You know what I'm saying? I think it should have, it should have just fresh. And Dover Street, again, you know, everybody's going to sit here and say, oh, it's because it's Dover Street. Been doing Dover Street a long time. We got Dover Street Air Forces. Been doing Dover Street a long time. Like, the Dover Street, there's a Dover Street dunk coming next week. Mm-hmm. I'm not getting it. I don't want it. Right. But this one don't right like here, it. though. This is dope. But I will tell you. The Dover Market Street Air Force One. There's a blue one around here somewhere. Like I've been doing Dover Street forever. You know what I'm saying? Like there's nothing new to me. So, like, like I like that because it's dope and it's a white Air Force. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, you hit the whole Dover Street play, but at the end of the day, this is this is a super dope thing. Like you know what I'm saying? Like I just love blue, the blue patent level on the Jordan one. And again, my personal favorite is the Air Force One. So you, you, you're looking almost at an Air Force One high. You know what I'm saying? But it's funny because I don't like dunks that much. <laughs> but it's just, it's, it's, it's weird. But those are the two right now. Those are definitely the two right now. And if you take all of those out of the equation and you go in that Nike, there's a, there's a Concepts. I know it's here, but I'm not going to look for it. There's a Concepts. There's two Concepts shoes that I love. The New Balance Hermes play, that orange one, that orange New Balance. It's like a... They got a cease and desist from Hermes, too. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Matter of fact, I'll pull them out. And then they did that, like, that 8-ball Asics. Like, those are non-Nike players that I love a lot right now. You know what I'm saying? Like, those two were dope. Those, yeah. those two were dope. But 
you know, that's that's far as I'm concerned. But I hate doing those lists, man. Yeah, I, I used to I used to be a part of those lists and do those lists with other sites and all that. Yeah, and yeah. I got tired of everybody putting their friend's shoes on a list because their friend was in the room doing the list with us, and that used to drive me up the wall. I was, yeah, the shoes not hot. And sure. if your shoe didn't come out for retail, like Clark, for instance, we put Clark's one one two on the list, like his his LeBron seven. Mm-hmm. I'm like, yo, dude. I thought that was the last time I did the list, probably five years ago. Mm-hmm. I'm like, yo, dude, your shoe didn't come out. It's dope. It's one of the dopest shoes I've seen all year long. But it never came out. It didn't come out, so right. it shouldn't be on the list. I get voted out. And again, yeah. this is my brother. Like, me and Clark got 25. I, there's nobody can tell me nothing about Clark. I can say whatever the fuck I want to Clark. Clark says whatever he wants to me. That's my brother. Yeah. We fight. Like, we're brothers. <laughs> we fight. I didn't think the shoe should have been on the list. It's an incredible shoe, though. You know what I'm saying? I mean, kind of like, I mean, uh, I was at Flight Club today, and I said, I said, what, what's the deal with those China foams? And they're like, oh, those got released in like one city in mm-hmm. China. Like, I paid $2,700 for yeah, that shit, Yeah, you, you, you cannot go it. into any store and buy those anywhere in the U.S. I bought it, man, and I'm mad that I, like, I, I just reached out to Nike. I told them my story. Yeah. I told the dudes that I know with marketing, and maybe there's a pair on campus, like, yo, <laughs> I didn't ask y'all when I wanted them, I went out and bought them. This happened. Help a brother out. <laughs> if you can. If you can. I just lent your shoes. Help a brother out. When you go non Nike, non Jordan stuff, um, a couple of things hit me that I that I'm I'm a fan of so far. I know there's a lot more stuff coming, but this this luxury goods, new balance. It's supposed to be the Hermes joint. And they got a cease and desist on this, but like this whole Hermes play was dope for me. You know what I'm saying? Like I like this a lot. This shoe was dope. Shout out to my people at Concepts. You know what I'm saying? I told you the story before with Concepts, but they always been good to me, so to get seated at parodies, you know what I'm saying? Like this was dope. Uh, how much do those retail for? Probably two hundred, probably. It's not bad. I don't even remember, but these are dope though. So to, you know, you'd be able to get a pair of those. And then um, again, non Nike, you got your Asics. This eight ball joint that they did. Concepts did this as well, like the whole eight ball play and all that stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like this is my era. You know what I'm saying? Like that crack era, that that that, that coke era. That's all my era. You know what I'm saying? I survived the seventies, eighties, and nineties. I'm forty years old. You know what I'm saying? So. I survived all that, so I'm proud of that. Never got high a day in my life, but this was always like, I grew up in the streets hustling, B, so like this is this is the whole thing. And then to top it off for me, man, like, again, when you go in non-Nike, everybody knows me as a Nike guy, this runs neck and neck. This runs neck and neck with my Air Max. Like, I told you this was my favorite shoe, and again, as I'm, as I'm walking around the room, and I, I had to come back and sit down, like, I'm probably gonna lean on the King Push. Like, like this, this EQT was crazy, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, like this is just, like, again, this is my life. You know what I'm saying? So this was my life growing up. So history, because you love the Air Max, and I love the silhouette of the Air Max, and like I said, Air Forces haven't been great this year. So, so far. Um, I'm here with it. Like, I'm right here. I'm here. Shout out to the architect. <laughs> Shout out to my man, King Push. Like, these are them for me right now. Like, like, I can't explain this one. <laughs> like it's really hard to explain, but it should have just. I was there, so I was there. Speaking of special shoes, and nobody has. This is a one of one, New York Yankee Air Force one. Last time the Yankees won the championship. 27th championship. Woo! Number 27. This was made in the Nike kitchen. DBs, they're so unique and the story behind them. That's the main thing. The story behind the dome bank of the kid that designed them. Time and effort, the way they release is pretty interesting. So 